we decided we wanted to create our very own STL Flix filament. Ambitious? Well, definitely. Soon enough, we learned that running a filament factory is actually very complicated. So buckle up because your new favorite filament has arrived in the USA. Today, we're thrilled and honestly super proud to finally share the story behind the brand new STL Flix filament in the United States. If you've been following us for a while, you might already know that we've gone through quite an adventure to bring these filaments from concept to reality. But now, thanks to the incredible support of our community, these pools are officially here and they are ready to shake up the market. I want to invite you to stick around because in this video, I'll be sharing how we developed our very own line of filaments and all the bumps and twists on the road. Why they stand shoulder to shoulder with some of the biggest names in the US and global markets like Eson, Polymaker, Hatchbox, and even Prusament, but at a truly competitive price. A breakdown of the final pricing, including our brand new flexible bulk pricing once you buy four or more spools. And how to buy these filaments, but that is only if you're already an STL Flix subscriber. And how that all ties back to the STL Flix and the STL Flix My Store. Whether you're a maker who sells your own 3D prints, or if you just love playing around with your printer for fun, we think you will love what we have in store. So buckle up because your new favorite filament has arrived in the USA. But before diving into the juicy product details, let's roll back the clock about a year ago. We decided we wanted to create our very own STL Flix filament. Ambitious? Well, definitely. But we're known for having big dreams, right? After all, we started with an idea to build the biggest STL subscription platform in the world. And now, almost three years later, here we are, shipping more than 80 premium 3D models every month with an ever-growing community of more than 30,000 active members. Uh, so the idea behind the STL Flix filament was born with a simple question. What if we could print all of our models using our very own filament that meets our own high standards, beautiful finishes, reliable material, and a cost that wouldn't break everybody's bank? If we do so, everybody will be able to achieve the same results as we do. And members who already use our photos and videos to promote their products, to promote their brands, will be able to use that media with much more confidence. Because in the end of the day, what you will be displaying is exactly what you will be able to make in your house as well. But let's be real, the US market is home to some of the truly excellent filament brands. Polymaker, Eason, Hatchbox, Cruzaman, Cookie Cat, just to name a few of the very well-known brands that are out there. They are known for their quality and consistent spooling. Competing with them would mean high quality materials, a great manufacturing process, competitive pricing, and above all else, aesthetic brilliance. Because we really care about having stunning prints in photos and videos. That is key to inspire our community to print our models and it all it's also the key for you to promote these prints as well and for you to sell more. But we also have another big challenge. We got a giant community spread across the globe. Brazil, all over Europe, all over the US, which happens to be the majority of our audience as well. So from day one, our plan was to create a line of filament that could be distributed globally. If we were going to do it, we wanted to do it right. So we started to explore three potential strategies. Build our own factory in the Brazil, in the US, and maybe in Europe as well. The second one would be partnering up with a single manufacturer that could handle this massive distribution. Or the third one, find multiple global suppliers for different continents and reduce fright and production lead time. Soon enough, we learned that running a filament factory is actually very complicated, especially when you're dealing with complex supply chains and you want to maintain uniform quality across multiple continents. So being honest with ourselves, we scrapped that idea of building our own facility. If we don't know how to properly run a factory, why would we have to reinvent the wheel? Instead, what we decided to go is all in on one big supplier to find the best supplier out there. We wanted to keep the process global, but consistent. And little did we know that finding that perfect manufacturing partner would be quite a roller coaster ride. And we evaluated a lot of different suppliers. We tested over 20 different suppliers. And when I say 20 different, I actually mean 20 different suppliers. Uh, we evaluated the samples that they sent to us, user reviews, user feedbacks, mechanical tests, a static checks, you name it, we tested everything. And this was not an easy test, but here's how we first approached it. The first thing that we looked for was reputation research. We specifically looked for a supplier that had a positive track record on platforms like Amazon, 
And why? Because the US market is famously demanding. If you mess up a spool tolerance or a color consistency, you're going to hear it about it on the Amazon reviews. And the feedback is usually spot on. Next, we looked at the quality of the raw material. We insisted on using top tier NatureWorks PLA pellets. If you're deep enough into 3D printing and you already studied a little bit about filaments, uh, you might already know that NatureWorks is widely considered one of the best, if not the best, provider of PLA resin in the world. Many top brands already use NatureWorks PLA. So if a supplier wasn't working with them, we didn't move forward with the negotiation. The next step on the process was to evaluate the manufacturing process and machinery. Because having a premium raw material is only about half of the equation. Because you also need a very precise manufacturing line to ensure the spool uniformity when you look at the spool and it's very well lined up, uh, one line up there the other. Uh, you need correct extrusion temperatures. You need a very consistent diameter. Uh, and we were looking at a 0.02 millimeter uh, variation or even better than that, and obviously minimal moisture. Any supplier that we couldn't find these standards, we would uh, immediately cut it out. The other thing that we evaluated very carefully was color and appearance. At STL Flix, we are visually driven. We create thousands of 3D models and we want them to look stunning. This means that we needed color vibrancy and surface finish, the consistency of that dual silk transition. If it didn't impress us from start, we would move on. Those things would matter a lot to us. And last but not least, price. No matter how good the filament was, we always came back to affordability. This was one of the things that we were looking for. Our whole vision was, and still is, to offer something that stands to toe to toe with some of the top brands out there in terms of print, but at a price that is accessible, especially if you're a maker printing for profit. The whole idea is that you would be able to save enough money on filament that would offset the cost that you would have on STL Flix subscription. So after a lot of back and forth, we ended up with one main partner that could handle our volumes and maintain a top quality for the US market and abroad. And to be honest with you, those negotiations were insane because they knew that STL Flix wasn't just another small local brand. They knew who we were. They knew that we were operating at a global scale. And suddenly we found ourselves with excellent pricing offers that at the beginning, we didn't even dream they were possible. But now let's talk about one of the things that we evaluated the most, the aesthetics. Sure, mechanical strength and consistent diameters are crucial, but we live in a visually driven world and we like to show off beautifully printed object. That's what STL Flix pretty much stands on. It's part of what powers the entire 3D printing community on Instagram, Reddit, YouTube, and beyond. The reason why 3D prints are being viral on all of these platforms is because they look amazing. So we needed to have that on our filaments as well. For the standard PLA, we wanted bright and consistent color. Any dull or inconsistent color would reflect poorly on our brand and in our creations so it was a no-go for us. The Silk PLA needed to have that eye-catching, almost metallic sheen. After all, Silk is the name and people want that wow factor, especially for decorative pieces or those cosplay props that STL Flix designed so well. And then we also have the Dual Silk PLA, which is possibly the most mesmerizing of the bunch. If you've presented a Dual Silk print to anybody that don't know anything about 3D printing, you'll see that people get impressed right away because they cannot even understand how is this thing manufactured? So we insisted that the spool would transition the color correctly so we wouldn't end up with those random segments of colors. Instead, what you will see in the SCL Flix filament is that harmonious shift from one color to the next as you print, as you can see in some of the videos that we're putting in this video. Because in the end of the day, we need to be able to use that filament in about every SCL Flix model photo and video that we put out there. We have to ensure that they look absolutely stunning. And if they look good, in the product photos, we know they will look good on your shelf or in your customer hands as well. Because after all, if you're going to sell that product, it needs to look exactly what it is in that photo that we are putting out there. Now let's talk about the sensitive topic, pricing. We knew that pricing would be a big challenge for us because the objective from the beginning was to offer a premium level filament at a lower price than most big name brands in the US. And that is very tricky because Let's face it, the US market is already very competitive. So to keep these costs down, we're buying large quantities up front. We believe in these filaments. So we're willing to make big orders to keep the costs down. We're also working directly with one main supplier rather than lots of smaller ones or a chain of distributors. And by doing that, we reduce overhead costs and those savings go straight back to our community. And obviously we cannot forget 
that we ran the special lifetime subscription promo back in November for both STL Fix and STL Academy. And the funds from that initiative fueled the big filament push, building up enough capital to order a massive amount of filaments at once, store them and handle the global distribution. So thanks to the folks who got on board with that lifetime deal, we're all reaping the benefits in form of a lower price per spool. An important note, those lifetime deals have already ended. So if you missed it, don't fear, we still have other subscription plans. Uh, but the big takeaway is that our community made this filament a reality by embracing our vision. So without further ado, what is the final price here in the US? And here's a breakdown you've been waiting for. If you're buying one spool of the basic PLA, it's gonna be $12. If you're buying one spool of the silk PLA, it's $14. And if you're buying one spool of the dual silk PLA, it's $16. But if you're buying two spools, you have $1 off per spool, which means that the basic PLA is gonna cost $11, the silk PLA $13, and the dual silk PLA $15. If you're buying three spools, you have $1.50 off per spool. So the basic PLA costs $10.50, the silk $12.50 and the dual silk $14.50. And over four spools, we already have the equivalent of a bulk pricing. And we take off $2 per spool. The basic PLA will cost $10 per spool, the silk PLA $12 per spool, and the dual silk PLA $14 per spool. But here's one of the coolest parts of our pricing standard, is that we have both pricing that is 100% flexible once you reach four or more spools. And here's what that means. You do not have to order four of the same color or even four of the same material type to access the disc. You can mix and match standard PLA, silk PLA, dual silk PLA, and any other color variant that we have available. As long as your total spool count is four or more, automatically unlock that extra $2 discount per spool. So if you want, let's say, two spools of standard PLA in white, uh, one spool of silk PLA in a gorgeous gold like this one, and one spool of dual silk PLA that transitions from purple to green, you will still get the four spool discount across the board. No other brand is doing quite like this. Most require you to buy a large quantity of a single color to see meaningful savings. We wanted to keep it as flexible as possible for you, the maker, so you buy exactly what you need to make your projects. So if you're an SEO Flix subscriber, you already know, we provide a massive life of high quality 3D models, all with commercial licenses. So you can print and even sell those creations. Now imagine pairing the designs with an equally fantastic filament that we ourselves recommend. The synergy is just unbeatable. Plus on each model that we launch, you will be able to see which filaments were used in that specific print. So you can instantly add those filaments to your cart. Additionally, you can head to the store for the first section of the platform and you can pick the filaments you need. So if you're not a subscriber yet, now it might be the perfect time to consider it. You will get unlimited access to thousands of premium 3D models and the chance to buy filament at some of the best prices around. It's a win-win, right? Okay, so now it's time to get a bit sentimental for a moment because this entire filament project wouldn't exist if it wasn't for the support of our amazing community. Last November, as I said, we ran a special lifetime subscription promo for the STL Flix and STL Academy with the clear goal of financing this venture. We explained we want to become the biggest brand in 3D printing filaments, just like we did with the STL subscription. But this is a project that demands a lot of capital. We need upfront cap. Once we secure that, we can stock enough spool and maintain consistent inventory and handle lengthy production and shipping timelines that we have when we're purchasing filaments. And guess what? You guys answered the call. So honestly, thanks to everybody who believed in this dream and we successfully funded the operation and now we have a robust inventory, a reliable production pipeline and enough spool variety to keep your printers humming for months. Even though those lifetime subscriptions have wrapped up, we continue to expand thanks to the foundation our backers helped to create. So from the bottom of our hearts, thank you. This project is truly a testament of what a motivated and enthusiastic community is able to accomplish. All right, folks, that's the full, and do I mean full, rundown of how STL Flix filaments came to be and they're worth checking it out. We know that this was a lot to take in, but if you've made it this far, here are the main takeaways. What we're offering is high quality at a low price, starting at $12 for the standard PLA, dropping down to as low as $10 when you buy four or more spools, multiple aesthetic options, standard PLA, silk PLA, 
dual silk PLA, mesmerizing cloud transitions, a community-driven filament that is funded by the amazing folks who believed in our vision in last November, and also the flexible bulk pricing. Mix and match any spool types or colors once you reach four or more spools. What you can do now, head over to STL Flix. If you're already a subscriber, check out the new filament section. If not, you're only going to be able to buy these filaments if you've become a subscriber. So stay updated on new color releases, printing tips, and user showcases. Share your prints once you get your spools. Tag us on social media with your creations. Show the world what you can do with the STL Flix filament. Thank you so much for watching. This has been a labor of love from the entire STL Flix team, and we are beyond excited to see where this journey is going to take us. With your help, we fully intend to push STL Flix filaments to the forefront of the 3D printing world, just like we have already done with our STL subscription service. So go ahead, give the STL Flix filament a spin and let us know what you think. And if you like this video, make sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe for more 3D printing tips, new model releases, and behind the scenes of the incredible things that happen here at STL Flix. And again, thank you for being part of our community. I'll see you next time. And until then, happy printing.